Today on the Treyarch channel, I'll be talking about pantothenic acid. Stick around. Welcome to the Treyarch channel. I am Ray Eptridge, your host, and this is the ninth part of the Essential Vitamin and Mineral series. Pantothenic acid, also known as vitamin B5, is a water-soluble vitamin. This means that it is not stored in the body, and like all the other water-soluble vitamins, it is dissolved in water and the excess is excreted. Pantothenic acid's primary function is to synthesize coenzyme A and acocarrier protein. This makes it essential for fatty acid synthesis and degradation. Because pantothenic acid is found in almost all plant and animal foods, it is very rare to be deficient in this. Pantothenic acid deficiency symptoms might include numbness and burning of the hands and feet, headache, fatigue, irritability, restlessness, disturbed sleep, and gastrointestinal disturbances with anorexia. The groups most at risk of pantothenic acid deficiency are people with pantothenic kinase-associated neurodegeneration type 2 mutation. So basically, very rare. The recommended daily allowance of vitamin B5 for children it, between 0 to 6 months is 1.7 milligrams and for children between 7 to 12 months it's 1.8 milligrams. The recommended intake for children 1 to 3 years old is 2 milligrams and for children 4 to 8 years old is 3 milligrams. For 9 to 13 years old it's 4 milligrams and for adolescents and adults age 14 and older it's 5 milligrams Unless they are pregnant, then it's 6 milligrams, or if they're lactating, it's 7 milligrams. So the top 10 list of vitamin B5 rich foods are chicken liver with 3 ounces at 83% the daily value, sunflower seeds with 3 ounces at 60% the daily value, avocados at 20% the daily value per average avocado, portobello mushrooms sliced at 19% per cup, salmon at 16% per 3 ounces, lentils at 13% per cup, corn, non-GMO variety that is, at 12% per cup, sun-dried tomatoes at 11% per cup, eggs at 9% per 3 ounces, and cauliflower at 7% per cup. As I've said before, the best way to get your daily dose of any vitamin or minerals is to eat a diet that has a variety of foods. Some doctors and nutritionists recommended eating two to three servings of vitamin B5 rich foods a day. Like some other water soluble vitamins, the excess of pantothenic acid is excreted and as such there are no known risks associated with taking it or associated with taking it in excess. However, the Food and Nutritional Board does advise against taking it in excess. So, how do you get your pantothenic acid? Let me know in the comments section below. If you have liked this video, please press the like button below, it's down to the side, and if you're not a current subscriber, please subscribe and you'll also see that button down below. And when you subscribe, please press the bell icon so that you can be notified of any new videos. Remember, your health is your wealth and you are absolutely worth it. I will see you next time. Bye for now.